Welcome back guys, so today we are seeing combinational and arithmetic logic circuits So we will study about multiplexer So a multiplexer is a combinational logic circuit which operates as a controlled switch with n number of inputs and only have a single data output So it selects one of the inputs according to its binary signals by the select inputs applied and passes all the information through the data line to the common output so therefore like this multiplex is also known as the data selector so the number of inputs are vary from 2, 4, 8 and 16 and so on then the operation is also like 2 is to 1, 4 is to 1, 8 is to 1 multiplexes so we will see how it works so this is a 2 is to 1 multiplexer it has two inputs D0 and D1 and one select input that is S and output is F the switch connects the output to one of the input depending on the select input so the value of select input is either 0 or 1 so that is the two possible ways for connecting it so if the select input is high the output will be switched to D1 and if it is low that is 0 then it will be selected to D0 so it will basically operate like the switch whatever data comes from here by selection line it will pass the data the output so we'll be designing a 4 is to 1 mux using 2 is to 1 mux so this is the circuit for it there are two 2 is to 1 mux three 2 is to 1 mux we can uh, we can also use the or gate here for this <coughs> but we have used the mux so we have this is our selection line this selection line is sorted because we'll use this to vary all the inputs so for for the first case suppose for this mux to activate we will pass 0 here so it, since it is an available bar it will become 1 and it will become 1 so it will become 0 it will pass through a not gate it will become 1 then it will again be inverted so it will become 0 it will be not activated so out, whatever output comes from here it goes there and similarly it works for this and when we want to pass like 1 this will get deactivated and this will get activated so this is the working of 4 is to 1 mux using 2 is to 1 mux so this was all about it so thanks for watching it